Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Nick from Noobkill coming at you with another man video today. So guys, you guys have been asking for seasons and we got seasons now in the game with Seasons Battle. So brand new program in the game. Technically, I guess it's a program or an event because it's under the event tab. It's a little bit different than last season's season. I know that's like a lot of seasons in one sentence um but of course last season's season um it was like you play the traditional season 16 games after you play the 16 games uh you advance onto the fi uh, playoffs i think I, don't, I can't remember if you played the finals i mean not in the four games like if it, it was like you don't have a buy so you play that first game then you play the semis then you play the conference finals then you play the super bowl right was it four or was it three was it just like conference um semis conference finals and then super bowl i cannot remember so it's either it was, it was 20 games in total or or 19 games total i can't really remember what it was but this time around they made it a little different and i actually i'm actually very happy with it with the rewards they're given out because um you do have to play 32 teams that's the big one that's the big kicker though um 32 teams and you will earn yourself an elite player guys so win games to unlock playoff battles um to unlock the playoff battles where you can earn extra xp and of course captain patches so that's actually not bad um a super Bowl victory will in, in, in give you a, an elite player so once you win all 32 games that's basically it so let's go to season battles it's under the the events tab so if we were on the main hub we can go to events right and it's right there boom smack dab number two if you guys have blitz tickets make sure you guys play the madden min it's super super easy you get 2.5k each time you play it um and honestly i have 140 uh 41k what just by playing the blitz events and i'm trying to sell some stuff right now um you guys see what i'm trying to sell so yeah I'm, your boy's trying to grind out make some coins and stuff like that now i will probably make this account the no money spent account because um we'll talk about that in actually no money spends but that being said guys let's go to the season battle so we already saw this page so let's click continue uh and boom here we go guys so you have every single team so we got the not 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 great teams and they're the 65 overalls okay some of them is a little questionable like texans at 65 texans i feel like are gonna be really good and last year it was like yeah, it was questionable actually actually last year uh browns of course are gonna be a lot better this year but they're the 65 overall players if you guys play these ones and beat them you will get a silver player pack i do not know if that's a silver or better i'm hoping it is so if you guys play the 65 overalls a lot easier you play those then we'll, of course we'll juice it up a little bit go up by one star um and that is of course the 70 overalls that's recommended for a 70 overall team um and then of course you got the Bengals, raiders falcons and stuff like that then we'll bump it back up to the 75 overall so that's another star added i believe yeah another star added and that is going to be the 75 with the Bills, the Cowboys, the Seahawks, the Lions. Um, and then lastly, we have the big boys, the 80 overall squad with the Patriots, the Eagles, the Steelers, um, the Jags. You know what I'm talking about? So, yeah, these guys are only four star. Now, when you guys beat these guys, you get 5,000 coins plus 200 blitz tickets. So, I like this because they're finally adding more currency into the game and stuff like that. Um, the, the 75s are 2K. And then, of course, the 70s you get gold players now, i don't know if this is gold or better i hope it's a gold or better but i just don't know if it is gold or better now when you guys play these games when you knock them out you will see at the top the playoff battle so if you win four games you will get yourself 250 captain patches and 500 xp then of course if you win eight games you get you double that and then of course the next one you add another 250 and then another 250 again and then another 500 for this one and then another 500 for this one and then lastly when you finish all 32 games when you win all 32 games that's technically your super bowl and bam you guys can see you get 2500 captain patches 5000 xp and elite player and elite player so that being said there also is a daily scrim um we're not gonna go for the 80 overalls i probably will do those off camera because i want to try to just make it seem like we're scoring as many points as possible so we're gonna play <laughs> we're gonna play the falcons bro we're gonna play the falcons well i want to see because i want to play this one and i want to see if we can get if it's a gold or better if it just says gold and that's it you know what i'm talking about so here we go guys let's go ahead and play against this game and i'm gonna talk about the launch and all that stuff we'll talk more in depth now you guys noticed that i noticed there's nobody in the stands i don't think they edit they program just yet that anybody's in the stands um 
so you guys can see that now I, i've actually switched over to the spread playbook i used to like the west coast playbook a lot but spreads and the captain bonus with uh camara is pretty fire now of course let's talk about some of the changes they did so there was that ama with of course mark price and ryan one of the developers on the madden team and you also had other developers in there as well such as my boy danny doberlin um you even had jeff younger um in there as well uh and i can't i think there was one more i can't remember the name or if there was even one more player person in in the q a beside mark and ryan and the other two names i just named um now they answered a lot of questions they said there was a lot of changes Ooh, oh now <clears throat> they did talk about the the analog stick i know the analog stick is actually like it's pretty bad it's always messes up in a pass play so if you try to get like a rat catch or you get a rat catch you try to get some more yards after the catch um you you notice that it's pretty hard to get the analog stick moving sometimes you know what i'm saying is it, it's terrible in overdrive it's really bad in overdrive because you can be like right there your dude will just stop moving and it's like come on man are you serious um so we're dotting up on this this falcons team as all right walker gets a touchdown there so they, they answered that question now they talked about season battles and now we have them in the game i'm really happy about that um a lot of people are saying like yo why can't we get like full games honestly guys we had a type of seasons in the game with of course um the live events if you guys ever went to um oh oh whoa 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 that, that's no good oh my goodness bro um but of course if you ever went to the 24 7 live events there was a game the events where you could play full games um and so you can play season technically games there i know it wasn't per se in a season and you wouldn't grind to the go to the playoffs and stuff like that but it was still full games what people were asking the tryout playbooks and stuff like that um so that was a that that was always there now they did add season battles so you can have like a uh i feel like okay what was that all about matt ryan yo you these guys are a 65 overall team bro they're playing like wonky all right that's interesting let's see if they run this with Devonte freeman i feel like they're gonna run okay maybe not um but yeah so oh yeah they are gonna run the ball so uh so they run the ball there um now let's talk about these season battles now I've seen a lot of people talk talking about season battle like oh my goodness it's such a long grind and this is what's funny to me this is what's the funniest part to me um if you guys are if you guys played last season the season before this you guys know that seasons is a grind it takes day it takes forever to play a season game uh, and that's what the biggest gripe was before like why seasons is a thing uh, people really didn't like season because it would take too long let's see if I get the kick okay I did not get the kick return uh part return um a lot of people said like yo like honestly one of my biggest things when you guys said like i we really need a season mode is a lot of people complained about this mode um and that's why they felt like they didn't really want to program it right away but there was such a big upcry and we do have it we have it in the game so that's awesome they added it back in the game they listened to some feedback um and it's in the game now people are saying like oh my goodness it's 32 games why couldn't it just be the traditional um what's it called 16 season playoffs and then you're done with and you got your super bowl right um and it, honestly it's what an extra 12 games if i if you count the buy because it was 20 games per season and honestly to complete the season you could do that in like if, if you wanted to grind all day you could possibly do it in a day and a half but you're sitting there playing out long long games just driving down the field trying to get a touchdown and stuff like that um so that that is a thing but uh it's funny because oh what a stiff arm uh, but it's like people were saying the rewards are not worth it and honestly i feel like they're pretty nice they're pretty nice and that's not me i haven't talked to any ea employee about season battles or anything like that um so if you guys think that yo they told me to say good things about it honestly i'm just saying what i think i feel like so i i think it's really good if you remember the seasons before like we had before you would play seasons only because it was part of the uh mobile master and it's for those achievements and you would get nothing besides the coins and last season they added those like locker items so yeah you get locker items and stuff like that and they it wasn't like a rewarding program it was not rewarding at all this time around we're playing uh, like 12 extra games you're getting an elite player you're getting what 40k you're getting 5k if you play all the 80 overall so that's 40k right there plus you're getting money for the the 70k ones on um, the 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 75 overall guys you're getting about 2k per there and then of course all the gold are better players and then all the silver players as well and then all the captain patches and stuff to me i think it's worth it i know i'm gonna be myself i'm happy seasons are back you guys know me i love seasons this is a great thing it's time to mess around with your players you build up a squad you built up a team you got them all there 
it's awesome i think it was needed that it's back um and now that they added rewards and stuff like that that is awesome that is freaking awesome that they're adding this if you guys don't think it's rewarding you don't have to play the, the mode now you know what i'm talking about it's not like overdrive it's not like overdrive where you have to play the mode in seasons to advance into the game you know it's not it's, it's an optional event which i like like that's why i feel like they might need to step it down a little bit on overdrive now let's talk about overdrive next um i really like the gameplay i like it a lot I, I think it's very tactical a lot more strategical than last season with just counters and stuff like that but of course they still need to work on it because it is a very oh how do we not pick up the fumble right there um but it is a very whoever spams kind of the most that's how it kind of is and but there is a lot of dampers the new ui changes or db changes that they did they made it a lot tougher they made it a lot tougher now as well what a throw at the back of the guy's head um, but yeah, they made it a lot more difficult to spam the same plays. The uh, the middle linebacker knows your tight end routes. Um, the cornerbacks guard way better now. Now there is like a little bug where your wide receivers they kind of like give up on the ball, and then the cornerback just takes it. The cornerback just takes it, which kind of sucks. Um, let me see if I can get that animation to come up here. I know these guys are like 65 overalls, but let's see if we can get it. So here we go. We're gonna get hit. All right, awesome. Let's try that again. We'll try that one again. All right. So we got this one right here. I'm going to step back a little, drop back, and we're just going to toss that as, okay, my guy's just going to burn him. As there, my analog stick is not moving. On the first one, I tried to juke. They got to fix analog stick. They know about it. They are working on it. So that's good to know that they are working on that. Now, of course, overdrive. A lot of people said we don't like that. It's archaic, and I get it. It's not traditional drive down the field, score a touchdown, and hey, that's the end of your drive. No, it's try to get as many points, and you can score up to a, you can, if you're really good, I think you can get to a 2,000 points. You know what I'm talking about? It doesn't seem realistic. You get points for yards. You get points for sacks. You get all that stuff, right? So they want the fantasy realm. So if you don't like overdrive, right? It's not like you can avoid it, like the plague. Like if you don't like the season battles because it takes too long, you can avoid it. You can't avoid overdrive. You cannot. It takes forever. Um, it's like the big part of the game. They renamed the game around Overdrive. You know what I'm talking about? So you know it's a big part of the game. But that's the only problem. If you do not play Overdrive, you don't like Overdrive, you got to play it. And hopefully they're, 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 they're tweaking it, which is awesome. But they're listening to feedback. They're trying to change things every single day. Um, but of course, if you don't like it, it's it's gonna be rough because that's how you get blitz tickets you get blitz tickets to play events and stuff like that to redo events to play them over again because there's no more stamina and i get it, it's frustrating you can always play unrank if you don't want to deal with it because if you lose you still get blitz tickets but it's just like it's hard i understand i understand the frustration if you do not like it because you do you you need it's like mandatory it's a mandatory thing and it's the one thing that they're kind of forcing you to play which is uh wow how the heck did he not catch that he was more interested to keep his feet in bounds <laughs> um but yeah i probably won't play this whole gameplay right here because like i said the games are longer they do take longer but i'm just trying to talk over things um but i'm glad it's back i'm hoping hopefully you guys are glad that season mode is back it is a little different this year has been a lot of different changes man and i'm kind of liking this different changes you know what i'm saying i know it is hard for accept change but i think it's for the better man i think it's for the better it was starting to get really stale as we get the pick right there baby as they gotta fix that my boy is running into my boy all right but <laughs> Um, I'm really liking the changes because it's like we've had the same game for four years straight four years in a row Yes, it's very fun as oh my goodness. I almost threw a pick. Let's see if we can get a touchdown a running touchdown with um, Our boy right here uh, Gordon Melvin Gordon. Here we go Skirt. Oh I ran into that. All right. No touchdown for me um all right but yeah that's fine so yeah we move on to the next quarter there is no more like you have to ask to leave i can just save and exit which is so much better um but yeah guys season battles is here tell me your guys your feedback looks like my game almost crashed um yeah season battle is here which is awesome i think it's in i i think it's really great i think 
that they do need to change some things here and there maybe make them like one minute quarters because it does take a lot longer um the best thing to do is of course run the ball run down the clock while you're running the ball and just make sure you score now the ai is is very improved on the 80 overalls um and your defensive ai is pretty dumb um so you do have to make sure you read the plays and stuff like that so yeah guys just tell me your feedback about uh, season battles i think it's awesome that we finally got seasons back in the game a little different but i accept the change and i like the change because you get so much more rewards it refreshes twice a month um so you guys get two elite players if you want to grind out 64 games and stuff like that and that's not bad because there's no other way to get players right now honestly there's no really other ways to get players as of right now so this is probably the best thing that i'm gonna do and especially if it's, you don't want to spend any money this is an awesome program for you because you get a player and all that stuff but yeah guys tell me your feedback seasons is back Thank you guys so much for watching. You guys are going to tune into for everything Madden Mobile. And that's right here on the channel. Always stay hyped, guys. And I'll catch you guys soon. Peace. What's up?